So today's video is a little bit of a show off for a set that I've had since 2005, I think, a DVD set, not a Blu-ray set. I'm not sure if this version of Gladiator is actually out on Blu-ray. You would hope it is. What we have here is a three disc set of Ridley Scott's Gladiator. Now this set contains the extended version of the movie and in a 30 second intro at the beginning of the film Ridley Scott does state that this is not a director's cut. He does not feel that this is a director's cut. I get the impression that either Ridley got sort of uh, persuaded money wise to do the extended version or whether there was something contractual that, that made it but he doesn't look too impressed uh, he gives a very basic intro at the beginning going here's some deleted scenes you might find them interesting you've seen the film before this isn't a director's cut that's pretty much his intro but we do get a pretty cool three disc set of gladiator oh, i've done with a cover there. i never even knew that did that all right so cardboard sleeve this is a region two set by the way i'm sure it is available on region one and what we get inside here it's pretty well presented to be honest is the three discs we do get a little bit of a booklet but to be honest the booklet's just like it's very basic there's nothing that you're going to learn in this booklet that you're not going to learn in the uh, crazy amount of special feature hours that are in this disc but i will get to those so disc one contains the movie now this version of gladiator runs for 164 minutes or just short of 164 minutes there are some scenes in there that they like ridley said they are interesting to watch 16 minutes of scenes all together in within the film uh, i don't think they make the film any better i don't think they make the film any worse they just make the film longer by 16 minutes so it is quite interesting i'm a sucker for director's cuts i love them and uh, some i prefer to the theatrical some i don't so disc two and disc three is where the special features are disc three and i'm gonna there is a reason i'm going three and then i'm saving two disc three has a, a large amount of little featurettes and lots of still image galleries about the image the design the costume design all that sort of stuff i've never really been a huge fan of photo galleries on dvds or blu-rays i don't tend to sit there and go next 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 i do look at pictures and storyboards and stuff online but as it comes to special features on a disc never really a huge fan of those but that's just my own opinion if you like that sort of thing there's a whole disc um dedicated to those but disc two however disc two is where the um or rather bonus disc one but it is disc two just for those smart alex that want to point that out disc two contains yet another one of uh one of the best making ofs that you'll ever see now there is a there is a thing i could actually do a video at some point about just how amazing this guy is uh charles de lazarica don't know if i've pronounced your, your second name right there charles but i hope i do i've always seen it written down and the work that charles does on making ofs and you've probably seen some of his making ofs he's done amazing ones for transformers 2 uh, exodus he did a fantastic one for Prometheus, which is well over three hours. He's, uh, I think the first one I ever saw that he'd done was Dangerous Days on the Blade Runner set, which is worth a purchase alone just for that documentary. I think it's like 200 minutes or something. This one on Gladiator, which is called Strength and Honor, Creating the World of Gladiator, runs for, are you ready for this? Three hours and 16 minutes amazing it is absolutely amazing i remember the first time i watched that documentary yes i say the first time i've seen it multiple times i sat for like a whole afternoon and watched it in a one uh, you can actually go in and, and watch it in in the uh the chapters so you do have that option but thank god there is a play all thing i do love the work that charles does and uh anytime there's a making of that, that he's been involved with uh, if you want to find out more of those, just go on his IMDb page. You can have a look and it will show you. I did that semi-recently and I'm like, oh, I've not seen that one. I ran out and I picked up the DVD. So I do have a few of Charles's um, 
documentaries to watch this fantastic work. Now, for those of you who picked up the original version of Gladiator, and by that I mean the theatrical one, there was a commentary on there by Ridley Scott. There is a new commentary on the extended version with Ridley Scott sitting down with Russell Crowe to talk about the extended version. That's really, really good. It's an interesting, light-hearted uh, chat track. What is also on the first disc within the movie is something called a historical and production trivia track. Now, that basically brings text up on screen, and it I watched it for a few minutes, and it brings up a hell of a lot of good information. So I would highly recommend that you do check that out. So if you're a fan of Gladiator and you don't own the physical media disc, then I would definitely check out this uh, special edition DVD. Thank you.